Hi. This slide asks us to take a sort of ancient wisdom and quantify it within our own business. Um, we've often heard that, that uh, in medicine, preventing something from happening is less expensive than uh, fixing it once it's happened. So preventative medicine as opposed to remedial medicine as opposed to waiting too long and then you've got a crisis in surgery What's, what's the relative cost? If it, if it costs resources, X, to prevent bad things from happening, then that's better than having to spend 3X to sort of say, oh, something bad happened, quick, get out there and try to fix it or turn it around, as opposed to, uh, gee, uh, we've got a, a full 10, 10 alarm fire going on here. Here we have fire prevention signs, here we have smoke detectors, and here we, we you know, did, waited too long and now the, the barn's burning down. We've also, of course, heard a stitch, one, one stitch in time saves nine, or one ounce of prevention saves a pound, which is 16 ounces of cure. So in our business, what can we do to prevent customers from ever getting dissatisfied or leaving? So that's prevention. Uh, not that e if they did leave, how would we know that they left the first month? Gosh, you know, they used to go buy 10,000 bucks a month from us, and this past month they didn't buy anything. Wouldn't it be nice to know that, you know, day one or two of the next month and run right out and say, gee, what happened? Clearly we're here at this stage, but we're not waiting a year and a half to say, didn't we used to do a lot of business with those guys? Let's go out and ask what happened and find out that they're very upset with us because how much could we have loved them if it took a year and a half to notice that they were gone? Um, now, keeping a customer happy is not the same thing as keeping them happy and making them so happy that they actually will spontaneously want to buy more or even more than that, they'd actually go tell their friends, you know, you need to buy from this particular distributor. So what do we have to do as far as our basic service brilliance plus additional things to retain penetrate, and then activate, get these people to actually talk about us and sing our praises. Those are the questions that come out from this slide. Thank you.